What's good everybody, it's your boy Beast back up in the kitchen Got another episode of Change Your Chicken This is my attempt to get you guys from you know eating this plain old chicken breast Whether it be grilled or just boiled I'm trying, to, trying to show you new ways to do it uh, Here goes some chicken breast already filleted And cut thin, no skin Here I have some ginger, one lime I have here some peanut butter, some soy sauce, reduced sodium, and some Westchester sauce. Yeah, I know, that's not how you pronounce it, but come on now. Hardly anybody knows how to pronounce that shit properly. Fuck out of here. But uh, moving on, this is what we're going to do. We're going to put two tablespoons of the peanut butter into a blender. As you see, I already have done that. I did it ahead of time because that shit could be a pain in the ass, you know, smacking the spoon against the blender trying to get it to come off so I just went ahead and did that first I grated some ginger about a tablespoon and a half all right we're gonna put everything into the blender I already squeezed the lime into a bowl the juice of the lime some pulp it doesn't matter because you're gonna blend everything put in some soy sauce about a half a cup that's exactly how much is left in the bottle around a half a cup's worth give or take um, I'm gonna put all that into the blender and then we're gonna put the Westchester sauce in the blender as well we're gonna put in about I would say you know I'm eyeing it but I would say about a third of a cup anywhere between a third of a cup to half a cup now that's it <laughs> just put everything into a blender and blend it and this is gonna be your marinade alright you're gonna blend this up for a couple of a minutes and that's because you want the ginger the ginger to really fully dissolve into the sauce into the marinade and that's it guys just pour it in over the chicken mix it up a little bit you know get a big bowl where you have the chicken at and just let it marinate put it into the fridge um for a minimum a couple of hours you could even do this the night before and just let it sit there overnight all right but at least a couple of hours all right and this really tastes really good go ahead after you're done marinating this when you're ready to cook preheat a skillet uh, now I, I ran out of olive oil but go ahead and use a tablespoon to a tablespoon and a half of some olive oil and you can start to cook it now you could cook it at a medium high with the olive oil but since I ran out I'm gonna cook it at a medium low all right, I don't want it to burn. All right, we're just gonna go ahead, put as many pieces of chicken as you want into the skillet and just cook it. This really does taste really good. I know the peanut butter really throws you off and you're like, what the fuck? But trust me guys, I've never strayed you, never led you astray with my recipes. I've tasted the recipes that I've made on this channel. So I know it tastes really good. Make sure you give this a try. If you have the ingredients, just give it a whirl, man. Give it a try. All right, here we go. Um, they're almost done. As you see, it's got a nice brown color to it. That's because of the peanut butter and the soy sauce and everything mixed together. And I went ahead and I just put a couple of these on top of some brown rice with half an avocado. And that was it. This is my dinner. Tasted on point two thumbs up give the recipe a try let me know what you guys think in the comment section all right i appreciate you guys watching as always hope all of you are enjoying your weekend out there y'all be good y'all hold it down